<laughs> Sounds like somebody's getting a bit broody there, don't I? I need a little convincing. Sounds like a lot to go through. It's, it's, it's never been part of my world. I've never been maternal. I've never been one of those girls that says, at this age, I'm going to have this many kids. And I almost thought I was going to kind of escape it, just take a wide berth and go around it all. And um, now it's kind of, I'm in a relationship that is just so right. Maybe I have to start thinking about it. What's interesting about Chris is that he's, he's not famous at all. Is that part of what attracted you to him? No, it's just him. Him with fame or without fame or being a celebrity or not being a celebrity, he would always be the same guy and he's just grounded and down to earth and oh, my friends and family love him, I love him, I love his family and it's just, it all works. And he's, I mean, he's a bit of a toy boy. I don't like the word toy boy because it sounds like somebody you're just playing with. You're, for me, you're 38, he's 30. But for me, he's my man. He's so man. He so looks after me. He's not my little plaything. He says you're the one. He knows it. Is he the one? For yeah, you? absolutely. Are you going to marry him? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I guess he'd have to ask me, wouldn't he? <laughs> what would you say if he did? I'd want him to be the first person to hear the answer, not <laughs> you. <laughs> Does it feel nice? that you've reached a place in your life where you found true love in your private life and actually you've become truly loved by the British public. I'd be happy enough just even with the first one, just to have found true love. I could honestly walk away from all of the performing if it's something that I wasn't good at and people didn't like seeing me do it. But to have both come together at once it's just incredible. And if I was a betting man, would you think worth a few quid on within a year married with baby? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Would it be a nice way for the, the fairy tale to end, do you think? I don't want the fairy tale to end. I want it to begin. This is the beginning for me. Would it be a nice way for the fairy tale to begin? I think there's some things, <laughs> and I've revealed a lot tonight, that are just between me and Chris. And as time goes on, we'll see what happens. Ladies and gentlemen, Danny the